Set the tachometer gauge face on top of the cluster and run the wires from the LED ring through the slots in the white plastic. Center the face on the white plastic shaft and lock the gauge face tab to the upper right corner. Using a small blade screwdriver, press the inner edge of the gauge face under the notches in the plastic shaft. Set the speedometer gauge face on top of the cluster. Make sure all the wires slide between the slots in the white plastic. Center the face so that the plastic shaft pokes through the gauge face. Lock the tab in the upper left hand corner of the cluster. Using a small blade screwdriver, press the inner edge of the gauge face under the notches in the plastic shaft. Gently install the RPM needle onto the metal shaft by pressing it straight down. Align the needle by turning it clockwise, then counterclockwise until the needle rests at the lowest indicated mark. Using the same method, install the temperature, fuel, and speedometer needles. When all the needles are installed, run the center wires through the center locking tabs in the top half of the cluster. Continue working the wires through the tabs until you can make the top half and the bottom half of the cluster. Set the cluster on its top and make sure all the wires are seated in their places. If everything looks good, press the two halves of the cluster together until the bottom tabs lock into place. Turn the cluster around and lock the top tabs in place. Tie the cluster halves together by reinstalling the two Torx 10 screws.